This video is about the saturate node in Unreal Engine materials. I'm gonna explain what it is, what it's used for, and how we can use it. So let's do it. I've created a master material with all the functions necessary for your projects. You can download it for free on my website. Link in the description below. Right click in the material graph and search for saturate. It has one input, one output and no settings here in the details tab. So what does it do? It's a special type of clamp which only limits the input value between 0 and 1. Values less than 0 are raised to 0, values greater than 1 are lower to 1 and values between 0 and 1 remain unchanged. Clamp does the same thing but you can define the minimum and maximum range. Watch the clamp video to learn more about it. So why use saturate? Why not just use clamp when it gives us more options and does exactly the same thing? The instruction cost of saturate is almost free on most modern graphics hardware. As it says here when I hover the mouse on the node. So we can use this node anytime we need to clamp a value between 0 and 1. And it won't affect the materials performance. What does it mean? The graphics hardware performs math operations whenever we add a node to our material. And clamping between 0 and 1 is a very common operation. We do it all the time in materials. When using the clamp node, there's a little bit of math that the GPU has to do. However, when using the saturate node, the GPU won't have to do that. So we should use the saturate node whenever we want to clamp between 0 and 1. I'll be using this node extensively in future videos when I want to create more complex materials. So that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel so you won't miss the new tutorials I'm planning to put here. Also join our community on Telegram, Discord and Facebook. If you have any questions, comments or concerns, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. Now, with all of that being said, I'll see you in the next one.